I had a very unusual experience. I had a tickle in my throat in June of last year that just wouldn't go away. Like it lasted a day and then two days and then uh, for the better part of a week I just had this constant tickle in my throat. I decided to go to a walking clinic and uh, you know, I know they're rushed for time there but it was just so rushed and like anticlimactic. I waited for two hours, the doctor brings me in, he just takes his light down off the wall, he shined it in my ear for a second, shined it in my mouth. First words he said, sir, maybe you have diabetes. Yeah, right? I was like, what did you see in my mouth that made you say diabetes? And he said, I'm pretty sure it was half a Snickers. So. I knew it was time to make a change, and another reason why I'm so very lucky to have the wife that I have, because she was just, uh, I went home and I told her, like, baby, I don't want diabetes. Uh, I don't have the discipline to like stick myself every day and check my blood sugar and stuff. So she was like, okay, if you're serious, then you gotta get fit. And if you really wanna get fit, you need to do a cleanse. Okay, the one, one husband who's here gotten this advice from his wife is chuckling, okay. My wife suggested to me that I do the master cleanse. Do you know it? Guy with eight pounds of nachos in front of him. Uh, no. Uh, <laughs> Oh, man, I want those nachos. Oh. <laughs> the master cleanse is a system whereby for seven to ten days, all that you consume is lemon juice mixed with cayenne pepper and maple syrup. And that's real. That's, uh, a, my wife told me that the theory behind it is that when you do a cleanse like this, it flushes all the toxins out of your body and uh, supercharges your metabolism so you can get fit. And those kind of things, like, they make sense to my wife because high school science didn't. Um, <laughs> but I did not have a better idea of my own, so off we went to Safeway. Uh, we bought the lemon juice and the maple syrup and the cayenne pepper, and I watched my wife mix them all together in the kitchen, and that is the point at which I lost my nerve. I just ended up using that stuff to marinate a bunch of chicken wings. <laughs> I call them the master chicken wings. <laughs> And that tip is right in time for barbecue season, so just take that home with you tonight. Uh...